the need to put an end to kidnapping, farmer herdsmen clashes, and other forms of crimes in the state informed the decision of the meeting between the leadership of Mieti Ala, Ondo State Government, and head of security agencies in the state. Governor Akire Dolu, who approved all the resolutions at the meeting, emphasized the need to put an end to night grazing, as well as compensate any farmer or herdsman whose crops or cattle may be affected by the activities of herdsmen or farmers. On the issue of night grazing and underage with dementia, we must look at that almost directly so that we can have a law that will ban night grazing and underage that are grazing so that, 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 are, that, are, that are going, we can call them herdsmen and their ex boys so we don't want them again. There are many reasons. There is no way a young boy can handle 500, 1,000 pounds. On his part, the National Secretary of the Mieti Ala, Usman Ungezena, who spoke on behalf of the National President of Mieti Ala, Mohamed Chirowa, assured that the association is prepared to assist the state government and security agencies to fish out the criminals tarnishing the image of the association. He urged arms headers to lay down their arms or face the consequences. We are here to fish out criminals among the first by any means. We will ask them to come and lay down arms in peace. If they refuse, we will uh, work with the security and go after them. We will develop ways of bringing uh, this criminal issue to an end in order to Heads of security agencies, the Army, police, DSS, and Civil Defense Corps, who participated in the meeting, warned that there would be no hiding place for criminals in the state. A 10 man committee was set up by the national president of Mietiala to assist the security agencies to fish out the bad eggs hiding under the name of the association to commit crime. From Akure, the Ondo State Capital, Jonah Omowa reporting.